Hello you guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Mary Margaret if you're new here and today we are doing a pack and prep with me for Puerto Rico. I am about to head to the hair salon. I'm going to, I think it's called Love Salon 30A. I'll have the name on the screen right here, but Maya is going to be doing my hair and I'm so excited. I actually don't even really know what I'm doing. I sent her a few pictures of inspo and it was like kind of what I have now, but just like more cleaned up. Definitely brunette, but a little bit of like blonde in there. I definitely like a more like warm honey toned color. So I think that's what we're gonna stick to today, but I don't really know what I'm I'm doing in terms of like cutting it and styling it and all of that fun stuff so I'll try and film a little bit when I go into the salon and I'll show you guys what it looks like I am back from my hair appointment and obviously I went a little bit lighter um, I love the way it turned out the girl who did my hair was so good I'll have her Instagram handle right here if you're local to 38 and want to go get your hair done she was so sweet and like talked to me through everything about what she was doing I showed her my inspo pictures and she absolutely killed it so this is how the hair turned out we ended up taking off I think she said she did like an inch and a half in the front and then the back of my hair was actually way longer than the front for some reason so I think she said she chopped off three inches in the back which is a lot because I was trying to grow my hair out which probably needed a good chop anyway so that my ends can continue to grow it's still long I'm so happy with how it turned out and next up we need to get my nails done I'm gonna try and book a Botox appointment I don't know if I'll have time to squeeze that in before we leave but I feel like my lip flip is slowly going away especially over here and so we'll try and squeeze that in but I have a manicure and pedicure appointment coming up so I'll take you guys along for that I don't know what I'm gonna get yet and then we need to get to packing too. I went and got my nails done this morning. I forgot to show you guys, so I'll show you them right now. I went with like this deep burgundy color, which is so different for me. If you've been following me for a while, you know I'm such like a neutrals, light nail person. Besides brown or like a taupe, but red is so outside my comfort zone and so unlike me, but I kind of love it. So cute for full. I mainly got them for Thanksgiving, but we are leaving for Puerto Rico in two days from now, so I'll have them there as well. But today we are actually doing Friendsgiving. So this vlog is like a pack and prep with me, but I also wanted to include our Friendsgiving um, because that is what we're doing today. And I need to start cooking actually because I'm on baked mac and cheese duty. And then I'm also bringing chocolate chip cookies. And I went and picked up these like frosted sugar cookies. I feel like there's a ton of controversy about these cookies. Some people love them. Some people absolutely hate them. I personally love them. So comment down below if you eat those or if you think they're like the grossest thing ever because Brindley like can't stand them and then I'm over here like eating the whole pack in one sitting. So that's what we're about to get started on. I need to get the noodles going and then I think I'm gonna put the cookies in first because the mac and cheese is also gonna have to go in the oven for a little bit before we leave. It is currently 2.26 and we're probably leaving here in like a little bit over an hour. And I still have to cook all this and get ready. I have no idea what I'm wearing and I have to do my makeup. Have not even really started packing and I think we're also having a meeting after for honey. So this day you guys. <laughs> I've been running around like a crazy person between like moving, organizing, cleaning, running errands, prepping for this, prepping for our trip. Like my brain is frazzled. So I'm gonna try and enjoy myself tonight, but we have to make it there first. So we've got a lot of things to get done before we can leave. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the so future good. is bright i 
20 minutes to do hair, makeup, and outfit. I don't know why I'm breaking out so bad. I swear every time I travel or I'm about to travel, I always have like a huge pimple pop up. Side side and through and through. No limit to what we can do. Okay, I think this is gonna be the final fit. I know it's not very like fall, but we are in Florida and it's literally 80 degrees outside. So I'm just wearing this little hat from Gigi Pip. I feel like this helps get the fall vibes going. And then this is just a basic white tank from Amazon. And I have it paired with this maxi skirt that's actually also from Amazon. <laughs> Didn't even mean to do that. And then for shoes, I'm wearing my fuzzy Birkenstocks. They're like Sherpa material. I get so many questions on them. So I'll link them down below if you want to go and get them. But I think this is the fit. Hopefully I don't change. I haven't seen what anyone else is wearing, so I feel like if I start seeing that, then I'm gonna second guess this. But as for now, this is what we're going with. We've got both cookies set up right here. And then under the tin foil, I have the baked mac and cheese. This thing is literally scalding hot, so I don't know how we're gonna transport this there, but it smells so good. I'm so excited to eat it and see what everyone else brought. Look how cute. She did a signed seating. I am obsessed. The little Sherpas, these little plates. Grace did so good setting this all up. Oh my gosh. Last night was seriously so much fun. There was like, I think 20 people last night and everyone brought such good dishes. Drake did the turkey and I swear that was probably one of the best turkeys I've ever had. And then I brought the mac and cheese and cookies and McCall brought mashed potatoes and gravy and like people brought fruit trays and pies and just so much stuff. So we ate really good last night and just had so much fun hanging out with everyone, getting to like catch up and see people. So that was a ton of fun, but it's now the next morning and today we are actually leaving for Puerto Rico. It might be a little bit confusing, so I figured I would just explain it real quick. So today we are driving to Louisiana because we're gonna fly out of New Orleans so that my parents can watch Ranger while we're gone. He does really well at their house. so that that's why we're flying out of there. So we're gonna drive to Louisiana today. And then tomorrow morning we have a flight to Orlando and we're actually gonna stay the night there. And then the next day we'll be flying to Puerto Rico. So we kind of have like an extended travel situation just because of like the two extra days, but it just makes the flying process to get there a whole lot easier. Um, so that is currently the update. I am sitting in the like office content creation room right now and as you can see it's actually a disaster um when we got home last night i tried a few outfits on so that is what is all behind me that's all stuff that i know i'm bringing i just need to actually get it into the suitcase now so we are heading out probably in like an hour or two so this is probably the most last minute packing i've ever done i usually pack like the night before and then i'm ready to go but I was just exhausted last night. I'm surprised I even started trying stuff on. So 
at least I got a little bit of a head start. Now it's just like getting everything into packing cubes, toiletries, all of that. So that is what I'm about to start doing. You guys, we actually, I know I just thought I was about to start packing, but we got our samples in for one of our first spring drops. I might get in trouble for showing you guys this, but I just have to. So if you made it to this part in the video, you're one of the lucky ones. I'm only gonna show you all very, very small. <laughs> That's all you're getting. I'll show you one other one. Do y'all see that? I'm so excited. I'm bringing a few of them to shoot content while we're in Puerto Rico because it's obviously gonna be like stunning and I'm like, how could I not bring honey? So that is what we're doing. I have a few other swimsuits that I'm bringing as well that are just like for fun, but obviously I have to shoot honey and get some content while we're there. All right, here is the update. We have toiletries and makeup on the side. And then that is my airport outfit for tomorrow. We've got the tripod, my getting ready headband. And then on this side, we have my big main bags of clothes, a beach bag, and then I've got my purse and some shoes up here. So this bag is pretty much done. And then Frontier actually sent over a base duffel bag, which I literally screamed when I opened this because I've always wanted their duffel. It's so cute and perfect for travel days. So this is actually going to be my carry-on slash personal item because I was able to fit some stuff in here, but like also has my laptop and charges and all that. So I'm gonna wanna be able to access this. It has like the um, like long duffel shoulder strap, or you can do the two shorter handles, which is nice. Look how cute they put like a little custom name tag. I need to fill out my information on that, but this is just the cutest bag. Here's like all my stuff inside. Um, it actually fits so much. You have like all of this right here. This is a laptop compartment. And then there's a zipper. We've got little storage pouches. We have another pocket on this side, a zipper here. And then what's super nice is this bottom half fully unzipped so like I have shoes in here I have the bikinis in here I was able to fit like a whole outfit change um in this bottom section so if you've been thinking about getting the base bag I honestly couldn't recommend it enough this is the mini one I know there's like a bigger version so I think if I was to purchase it again I might go one size up just to fit like a little bit more but if you're just doing like weekend trips and stuff like that, then I feel like this is a really good option. Ranger is growling at his stuff. Poor guy gets so nervous every time we travel. So like once he sees us take out his like travel bag, we put like his food bowl and toys and all that stuff in here. He gets so nervous, but it's okay. You go on the stage of grandma's. Huh, yeah, see, I love their house. Noah's finishing packing up his bag. This is my travel outfit for the day. I'm wearing just like comfy loungewear because I want to be comfortable in the car. And then I'll also probably will fly in this tomorrow to Orlando. And then I have like a cute travel day outfit from Orlando to Puerto Rico. Uh, but this is just a like basic Heather Gray crew neck. And then these gray lounge shorts are from Aerie. I will link them, they're so comfy. I'm doing a size small. Um, I could have done extra small, but I wanted kind of like a looser baggy fit. And then for shoes, I'm wearing my New Balances. I got these on Amazon as well as these little high socks. I will link those down below as well. Early, we are now in Puerto Rico. I was so bad at vlogging today. I wanted to include like our travel day and our Airbnb tour or our resort tour and literally did not film a single thing from today. So I'll pop in a few pictures from like our travel day. Um, but we are here now and we've been here for probably like an hour. Our room service just got delivered, so we're about to eat. But before this room gets any more messy, I'm gonna give you guys a quick little tour of where we'll be staying for the next week. Right when you walk in, they have these two like locker cubbies. So we'll probably put like our shoes and stuff and hang some things up here. And then from this way, we have a mini kitchen area. And as you can see, they completely stocked it for you guys. They gave us two speakers that charge your phone. We've got gummies, goldfish, we have Pinot Grigio. They also gave us rum and tequila. So 
We'll have some good drinks while we're here. They also gave us some soft drinks, gum, gift cards for Ubers for when we're coming back from the city. And then we've got a cute little trucker hat, some beach towels, disposable camera, which I am so glad they have this because I forgot mine. I was just telling them I wish I brought it. So super excited to get to use that. And then we have these two little like really cute beach bags. I see these all over the place in 30A. So I'm excited to bring those back. And then we've got sunglasses. I think Noah already took his pair that was right here. And then we've got some koozies, a really cute tote bag. And then these are little hydration packets from Waterboy. I've always wanted to try these. Um, it's Jenna Palak's boyfriend's company. So look at how cute they like added all of these little like personalized details. It has our names and then this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they literally have my face on the frontier plane. Like, I can't even, they just went so over the top and we feel so spoiled. All of these bathroom products set up as well. So we have little eye patches and then they set up all of these sun care products from Kula. I've used this brand before, but I don't have any of these specifically. So excited to try these out and take those back with us. And then more like closet hanging space here. They have robes and then slippers. So I will definitely be using those at some point. And then this actually like connects and circles back. So Noah's already digging into our food. He's sitting in like the little living room area. It circles back to the kitchen. And you come out of the bathroom is the bedroom. So here is the bed. They had some towels laid out. They have like hiking boots for me. And then these little like they kind of look like chacos, but they're just like adventure sandals. And then they got a plain black pair for Noah as well, which is seriously so nice. We have a big balcony out here. And I think where we are is technically like considered villas. So the spaces are a lot bigger. We have a big private pool back there. And then we can circle back and go to like all the restaurants and coffee shops. But yeah, we are going to dig in. We got some fruit salad. Noah did a club sandwich and then I just got chicken tenders. Probably end the vlog off here and I'll pick back up and start our full Puerto Rico vlog. Taking you guys along for the entire itinerary that they have set up. We're doing some really fun things. So definitely stay tuned to watch that video. But for now, we're gonna eat. So thank you so much for watching. Like this video and subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you guys in the Puerto Rico vlog. Mm -hmm.